All right, here we go. This is uh, part one of the uh, Pilot Edge Los Angeles uh, area alphabet challenge, where there's uh, 35 flights uh, to cover airports of every letter of the alphabet and then uh, numbers as well. So today we're going to fly the first uh, leg of that. This is um, flying from Apple Valley which is uh, K-A-P-V on up to uh, Bakersfield BFL. It's about 112 miles by the time we uh, navigate through these VORs here. And some, we're going to skirt under some uh, cloud layers on the way up here. So, um, let me show you the route. Um, it's going to take Apple Valley. We're going to direct the uh, Palmdale VOR. And then uh, on up to Bakersfield. So let's go ahead and get started up here the engine seems ideally primed find some information here about the field. It's uncontrolled. Uh, so maybe we'll try to get the weather from Southern California Logistics Airport. the nearest airport it looks like uh, with weather 118.35 we'll put it in our comm too check out the weather number 4 5 x for Santa Barbara approach Actually, sorry, that's my fault. That's the wrong frequency. 135, 475 is the ATIS. Advise on initial contact. You have information November. Southern California Logistics Airport, ATIS information November. 1846 Zulu, wind 1405, visibility 7, light rain, ceiling 3000 overcast, altimeter 3010, arriving and departing runway 1721, ALS runway 17 approach in use. Alright, so uh, 7 miles visibility, overcast 3000. So. Twenty two eight is the CTAF here. While we're here, let's go ahead and put in our flight plan. Uh, this is going to be direct PMD VOR. PMD VOR and then 
Direct K BFL. Meadows Field. And while we're here, let's go ahead. Put the VOR frequency uh, in our nav one. It's fourteen five. Whoops. We'll attempt to navigate via VORs, including after we pass that VOR. Let's go ahead up here to Bakersfield VOR. Sorry, it's the sh Shafter VFR 115.4. Will be the next one that we'll tune. All right. We know it's going to be a west. We may not be able to see it from the... All right. Let's go ahead and set a few things. First of all, 3010 was the nearest altimeter setting. Uh, 165 is uh, current heading, and we'll set our Attitude indicator. All right, taxi lights on. We'll go ahead and make a call. Apple Valley Traffic Skyhawk, November 3852 Lima, taxiing to runway 18. We'll be making a uh, departure from the area to the west, Apple Valley. We'll taxi on up to uh, runway 18. Um. And then we'll do a run up before we go. We'll try to pick up flight following once we're airborne. So I'll go ahead and look up what uh, the nearest approach frequency is here. Joshua approach on one, two, four, five, five. So we'll be ready to contact Joshua approach once we're out of here. Looks like we're going to want to fly a heading of about, let's see, two, sixty, two, six, zero, roughly. We'll go ahead and put our heading bug on uh, two, six, zero to remind us.
That's where my goes forever. little run up area all right let's uh, check on some things here Correct. Instrument instruments look good. We set our flight instrumentation. We're set on our VOR. Um, our flight plan's loaded into the 430. We're squawking uh, 1200. Departure Joshua approach is loaded into our second, I mean our COM1 on our toggle here. Um, let's go ahead and do a quick run up. Bring these up to 1800. Left mag looks good, back to both. Right mag, back to both. We have vacuum, ammeter looks good, fuel gauges uh, are good. All right, let's just double check. Mixture's rich, trim is set for takeoff, fuel selectors on both, flaps are up. Lights are on. Let's take one eight, um, and we'll make our call and get out of here. Apple Valley traffic, Skyhawk three eight five two Lima, taking runway one eight. Going to be making a right hand uh, turnout to the west, Apple Valley. All right, approach in looks clear. Approaching runway one eight. Departure in looks clear. I see 1-8 on the runway. Southbound heading indicator. Mixtures, uh, power's coming in. Right rudder. Engine instruments in the green. Airspeed's alive. There's 40. There is 55. We'll rotate up here. few hundred feet we'll uh, make our turn out to the right and then we'll call Joshua approach we'll start a real easy right hand turn Joshua Approach, good afternoon, Skyhawk 3852 Lima, VFR request.
We're going to level off at 4,500 for now. Because of uh, cloud coverage for now. So we'll level off, reduce power. Joshua Approach, Skyhawk 3852 Lima, VFR request. Eight five two Lima is a uh, 172 slant golf. We're approximately two miles west of Apple Valley Airport at 4,500 currently. Uh, looking for VFR flight following uh, up to Bakersfield, Bravo, uh, Froxtrot Lima. Two two four two and ident five two Lima. All right, so you can see we're flying um, pretty well based on VOR nav right now, hand flying this whole thing. Let's lean a little here once we get um, So obviously, if this were real life, I would not be flying in this cloud as a non-instrument rated pilot, but I'm going to use this as an opportunity to practice my instrument flying. All right, so in about 24 miles or so, let's see, we're going to turn uh, right. Let's just see if we can get an idea of what heading we're going to be going to. We'll look at this on, we'll kind of keep start tracking this on uh, on this nav. It's going to be a turn to the north. The other cool thing. TBM Alpha Victor 3000 calling 5000 on 251 heading. TBM 18 Alpha Victor, so Archer Radar contact climate team 900,000. 900,000 Alpha Victor. Who else call? Let's go ahead and put. um Radar contact climate maintain 8000. Let's go ahead and put our final destination, uh, the Vortac. At the last destination we're going to.
Ah, Meadows Field. Let's start. 1500 pattern, 500 feet AGL. One three zero twelve. So we'll be landing one, two left and right, probably. So let's make a right downwind. Hopefully we'll get a right downwind for or left downwind for okay, yeah, it's fine. We either come in over on the right side of the field, which would be a left downwind for one two left. Or will it bring us on the left side of the field, which would be a right downwind for one two right. And it looks like uh let's pay attention here for just a second. Make sure we haven't drifted too much. The compass is reading 302. All right. Just realign the uh, DGI with the compass a little bit there and get us back on track. trying to figure out when I can get down from 6,500 here. Looking ahead on this map. Uh, I'm up in the terrain over here. We got to get over this ridge. And then it looks like it drops off down in this area. So one way we could do this would be to know when it was safe to descend. I could draw a line here past this ridge. This would be on the Let's just say the 200 degrees to the 200 degrees to the Gorman VOR. So what we would do would be put 116.1. We put 116.1 in our nav too. And I'll set my. I'll go ahead and set this up to 200 degrees. So then, when this thing crosses center, we know we're past this ridge, and it's safe to start descending. I gave
Point. Five times. Music walk. Three times. Five times. 5,500 scattered. Feeling 7,000 overcast. Temperature 13. 2.7. Departing runways one two left, one two right. Visual approaches in use. Read backhaul runway assignments and hold short instructions. Advise on initial contact. You have information. Bravo. Meadows Field, Bakersfield, California. A is information. Bravo. One nine or five four Zulu. Wind one two zero at one two. Visibility 10. Light train. 5,500 scattered. Ceiling 7,000 overcast. Temperature 13. 2.7. Altimeter 3008. Arriving in departing runways 12 left. 12 right. Visual approaches in use. Read back. Number three, Mike, to the runway two nine, clear to land. Number 2775 Mojave Ground, where you park? Number 2775 Runway 30, taxi via Alpha. Three eight five two Lima contact to uh, Christian Center. Uh, sorry, yeah, Baker Shield approach. Baker Shield approach. One one eight point eight. One one eight point eight five two Lima. Delta Echo Tango Charlie Canada Point View approach. One two four point seven. One two four seven Delta Echo Tango Charlie. Baker Shield approach. Skyhawk three eight five two Lima six thousand five hundred. Three eight five two Lima Baker Shield approach. Baker Shield number three zero zero eight. Zero eight five two Lima. So you can see here our um, the little line I made earlier that's coming in that says we're out of the terrain um, is starting to come in now. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to start turning towards the field. I'm also going to start descending to get down to 4,500. And Delta Echo Tango Kilo Charlie. Uh, maintain appropriate VFR altitude. Since you're going eastbound, you need to have an odd altitude plus 500 feet, so such as uh, 5,500. Go direct. The Bakersfield. Delta uh, Echo Tango Kilo Charlie is climbing to 5,500. Gotcha. Papi Lima advise when you have Bravo and airport the airport site. Uh, we do have information Bravo and we'll let you know on the field 5 2 Lima. Alright, so this is saying 309. Ah. Number 4 Mike, Mike, Frank, ground. Where you parked? November for Mike Mike, runway 15, taxi via Bravo.
Start bringing the mixture in. Lights are on. Fuel selectors on both. Well, they reported 5,500 scattered, 7,000 overcast. So, Warning. Rain ahead. Bakersfield's going to be over this ridge. Eighteen one is going to be our tower handoff. Still 25 miles. Walker 175, Los Angeles Center, 133.2. We'll start descending because we got to get uh, quite a bit of ways down. So we'll just go to a nice 500 feet per minute. Walker 175, Los Angeles Center, climb, maintain, for level 300. Number 739, our Papa Golf, flatting 300, vectors to silence. Number four, my my rank tower, runway one five, clear for takeoff, and one two zero six. First seven three nine, our off, contact to call approach one three four point two. So call approach number two six Delta Charlie. Number two six up to Charlie Point we do approach. Hey, uh, I think it's a four eight so cal three about uh, twelve miles to the east of Catalan New York. Uh quite full stop at John Wayne. Alright, we're two six up to Charlie, your response was hard to hear you, but you're talking to Point McGoo approach. Uh, I control the area about 30, from about 30 miles west of Catalina. If you're east of Catalina, you need to try and SoCal approach on either 128.1 uh, or 127.4. Uh, 27 before that's when I look for 26 of Charlie Banks. We're 739 for the golf, SoCal approach, we're back altimeter 3010, information alpha is current. Uh, say approach request. I don't want to 
Runway 8. Never another hot Roger. Okay, heading. Temperature 13, dew point 7. Altimeter 3008. Different but Papa Gaw, say heading. Left, right, Niner, Papa Roger, thank you. Turn left, heading 260, but the final. All right, fuel selectors on both. Mixture is going rich. Lights are on. Uh, we are not mount east of the Catalina VOR in 2500, request full stop. John Wang, information to list. Or TC for the Charlie's Fox 6524 IDAN. 6524 IDAN, 26 Upstrong. For 2775, at departure. Departure number 2775, uh, we are. Headed southeast, uh, we're at uh, 4,460, uh, headed to 7,500. For 308, Charlie, Sierra Sam Tower, and away to Niner, clear for takeoff. For 2775, adjust your pressure radar contact. Next time, all you need to say on your call up for departure is just your altitude. Andrew Heading, if assigned. That's all I gotta say next time. I already see you on my radar. Altitude Heading, roger that. Number 2775, thank you. Number 2775, radar. Alright, we're gonna level off at 2500. We should have Bakersfield in sight soon. Bakersfield Airport, 12 o'clock, 1 5 miles, port site. Look in 5 2 Lima. Delta Echo, Tango Kilo, Charlie. Contact to come approach, 134.2. Contact to Corporal 234.2, Delta Echo Tango Kilo Charlie. Number 4, Mike. Mike, go ahead and start your turn south eastbound, please. Contact departure. All right, mixture's rich. Never yeah, mind, Mike. Uh, next time you turn southeast a little sooner than uh, as far as you are south. Go ahead and turn southeast and then contact departure, please. Number uh, T6, Charlie, radar contact, uh, one three miles northeast, San Catalina Airport, half mile altimeter 3008. 3008, uh, 26 I see it out there. Number 6, Delta Charlie, advise you have information on Oscar at yep. uh, John Wayne Airport. Oh, we have information to Lou, 26 Delta Charlie. So, Charlie, Roger, kind of approach, 128.1. 128.126 Delta Charlie. Took up road to Delta Echo Tango Kilo Charlie 5500. Delta Echo Tango Kilo Charlie, so call approach. We're back to altimeter 3010. 3010, Delta Echo Tango Kilo Charlie. Number 739 are popping off. Turn right, heading 010. There's the field. Zero. See it. Join the local ladder. 050 on to the Number 8, Charlie, Sierra, count departure. Bakersfield approach, 3852 Lima has Meadows in sight. 3852 Lima, enter the right downwind, or right 1 2 left, count at the tower, 118.1. Okay, confirm right downwind for 1 2 left and over to tower, 52 Lima. You turn the right heading 050. That's no problem. Continue your left turn now heading 050, please. Left turn 050. Meadows Tower, Skyhawk 385, 2 Lima, 12 miles uh, eastbound with Bravo, inbound full stop. Turn right heading 050. Mike, so call departure, radar contact. Cancel the altitude restriction. Resume on navigation. Number 
330 Charlie Sierra Santa Barbara departure radar contact also with you climb maintain 8000 Walker 175 go ahead Walker 175 ah, that's fine and I'm going to have a handoff here in about 40 miles Meadows Tower, Skyhawk 385, Tulima, 10 miles southeast, inbound with Bravo, full stop. 385, Tulima, Underfield Tower, enter the right down, enter right 1 2 left, port midfield. Right one or right down one for 1 2 left, and we're port midfield, 385, Tulima. November 7, 39, Papa Golf, you're 5 miles from the Silex, fly heading 050, maintain 4000 until established hazard, clear to ILS, right 8 approach. All right, let's hand fly this the rest of the way. Right down in one, two left, 1500 is pattern altitude. I'm going to enter 45. Let's also check real quick and see if there is an ILS for one, two left. If there is. What is it? There's not. Sam Lewis Ground, Skyhawk Center 2, 3 Mike Zulu is at the west ramp requesting taxi with Zulu. Uh, request cat free rating. For taxi 3 Mike Zulu. Sam Lewis Ground, where are you? We're at the west ramp. 2 3 Mike Zulu. Number three, Mike, so there were my two nine taxi via Echo Alpha cross from my two nine on Echo. Taxi via Echo Alpha cross from my two nine on Echo at Echo. Nine or two three, Mike Zulu. And number eight, Charlie Sierra, good right, Pasta Robles VOR. Approach one three five point four. Good day. Number four, my client contact approach one three five point four. Number two five eight six seven LA Center. Roger, maintain BFR and the. Uh, let's see. Las Vegas Altimetry 0 0 9 Yeah, I have no idea what she said. You sound like you're in three rooms away. Number <laughs> 308 Charlie Zero. Contact uh. me. Center 
All right, mixture's rich. Fuel selectors on both. Lights are on. Laps to go. And number nine, proper golf. You're barely readable. Our pattern altitude are entering the 45. Right downwind. Meadows Tower, 3852 Lima's midfield right downwind, 1 2 left. 4 5 2 Lima, Bakersfield Tower, 1 2 left, good land. Third land, 1 2 left, 5 to Lima. Let's get slowed up here. Just about a beam. San Luis Tower, Skyhawk 923, Mike Sulu is holding for the runway 2900 Alpha, ready for takeoff. For a beam, power back to 1700, first notch of flaps, let the nose come over. Zulu, San Luis Tower, 2900, takeoff. And start a descent. Left close traffic, two three, Mike Sulu. Left close traffic, forward midfield down one each time. Midfield down wind, left close traffic, two three, Mike Sulu. Not quite yet. The descent coming. Second notch. The nose over. Power. Third notch. Down about sixty five. Right about here feels pretty good.
Power's coming out. Power's out. And on the ground. Tower, November 25867, 10 to the north with Quebec. November 25867, Bullhead Tower, make straight in runway 16, report 3 mile final. Information in Quebec is current altimeter 3008. Straight in one ray 16867. Meadows Tower 3852, Lima clear of 12 left at Alpha 12. Parking via Alpha with you, 385 to Lima. Good day, great job. Yeah. All right, that is complete. We'll uh, double check on pilot edge, make sure that we got credit for being here, and uh, that'll be that. Thanks for joining me today. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. We'll do more of these coming up real soon.